Hi, my name is Janice Dundas. Hi, I'm Scott Fielder. I'm Arshin Ketsior. Mohamed Khan. I'm Chris Irwin. Franklin Garaspi. My name is Suzanne Ross. Ramesh Saxena. Andrew Scott. My name is Bernie Manette. Robert Richardson. Christine Fenning. <laughs> my name is Pamela Mayhew. Carl Oliver. Rick Simone. Dixie Seidel. Sharon Aka. My name is Doug Smith, and I'm a teacher. we must learn to do before we can do them. We learn by doing them. Her name was Miss J. She was one of the phys ed professors and I thought I want to be Miss J. She was really cool and she told lots of stories and she really made everything real. I'm almost Miss J. She had a PhD and I don't have that yet. <laughs> what comes to mind is my chemistry teacher. He just made learning fun. I guess it helped that he coached the hockey team and he created a cheer out of the periodic table. Okay boys, what are we gonna do today? Element 56, sir. And what's element 56? Let's bury him! There I am, I've kind of landed at this program at the University of Victoria, not really knowing exactly what I'm heading into. About day three, I'm realizing I'm hardly taking in the content, but I'm loving the teacher. The way that he teaches, he was always bringing it back to a context of a story. And I thought that was fabulous, and I just started to laugh because I said, oh yeah, that's great, but look at you. <laughs> One of the teachers who inspired me was not teaching technical courses, although he had PhD, he came to our level to explain things and that relate to how non-technical courses will help us in the real life. That inspired me. I am in the teaching field just because the way he taught me. I wanted to be him. My students say that to me. They say, you love what you teach. And so we like coming to class because it's always energetic and, and you're so enthusiastic that we can't help but be affected by that. So I try to have fun. I dance a little. <laughs> I would say the first thing is I'm a storyteller. You know, I'll just have conversations with them even before I start teaching and I ask if they have any questions. So I hope that engages students to share their stories. To inspire my students, I try to instill the idea that reality could have been otherwise or the world that we're in could have been otherwise than it is. So try to foster a kind of constant experimentation with their everyday environment and with everything around them. I hope that students can sense that I care about them. I really do care about each, each student. One of my real strategic moves is to try and build that sense of community in the students. I think it's important that students feel safe to, um, to share. I'm one voice within that classroom. There's 30 other people in the classroom, or there's 45 other people, or there's 100 people that also have a voice to share. I really have to push energy and enthusiasm and comedy to, uh, to kind of bring everybody out of their mathematical haze. So having fun in the classroom is how I try to keep everybody engaged and, and going. Let's all smile about it because this is so serious, you can only laugh at it. <laughs> What's not to love? It's that magic moment. Those moments of, oh my word, what they taught us really is true. I love everything about my teaching experience. I love that I can do something totally different each day and it works. Or if it doesn't work, I can try something different tomorrow. It's always changing. It's not stagnant. I like the fact that there's immediate feedback. I can immediately see whether they get it or not. I love being around the young people. The energy that they exude keeps me young. Watching the students on the very first day, and then I love watching them two years later as they walk across the stage in graduation and seeing the transformation that's taken place, the confidence that's come, the knowledge that they've gained, that is actually the highlight for me. Teaching is fun. Interesting. Funny. Vivacious. Supportive. An opportunity. Applicable. Cool. Engaging. Inspiring. Relevant and meaningful. 